Hi everybody, Kirsten here from Beyond High C and I want to share with you, but this is a consonant sound that um, many of my participants who have aphasia and they have few words that they're able to say, few words that people can understand because their articulators, their lips, their tongue are not taking the right message from their from their brain and we've been working on the sound that the letter b makes and actually in class this week we have been using bees and pollination this time of year uh, the positive things that bees do for us so one big thing i've been noticing is sometimes you are meaning to say B, but your lips don't come together. So I want to encourage you, you can do it with me now. You can look at yourself in the mirror, maybe get a little mirror and do this uh, so that you can see yourself. You can watch me first. I'm gonna be sure I put my lips together and take your time. B, oftentimes uh, people rush ahead and uh, they're not giving their their muscles time to do what they've been asked to do. B. So say that with me and really concentrate on your lips coming together and look in the mirror. B. 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 See if your lips are coming together. Sometimes you may not know. So I really want to encourage you to take a look at yourself to be sure. And this is something you could practice in your bathroom mirror right after you brush your teeth in the morning, after you brush your teeth at night, to give your articulators a chance to have some muscle memory going again. Let's do it one more time and then we'll put it with three short words that start with B. Here it goes. B. B, 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 one more, B, all right? Take your time to make sure your lips come together. That way people can understand you better. And that's what we're communicating for. All right, three simple words. Let's do big. Big, big, lips together, big, 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 big. Now let's say the word bad. Ready, go. Bad, 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 bad bad. Now we can say the word ball. Ready? Say ball, 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 ball. All right. Now you could repeat that. Uh, you could repeat that each and every day. And uh, I will make a, um, a short little exercise with visuals. Visuals can be helpful to end quick reminder. And you could go over to our website, which I will link right here. Go over and you can get that visual. You could have it on your iPad or your computer, or you could print it and you could take it into the bathroom with you when you look in the mirror so that you can see what to do, look in the mirror and do it, okay? B, need to uh, practice getting your articulators to work when you're asking them to. I thank you so much for watching. I hope you're subscribed to this channel because we have more content, more exercises and hopefully helpful things for you on the way. We know you can do it. If you keep practicing, keep working at it, I know that you can get your words out better. So I hope you're feeling hopeful about that and I hope to see you in the next video.